Firefighters battled water problems as well as flames at a house in Ross Township. Several people were inside that house when it caught on fire. Pam Serrano is live to explain how firefighters overcame that water issue. Pam. Good evening to you, Susan. Pitview Road and all of the surrounding streets in this Ross Township neighborhood were shut down for hours tonight. A massive amount of fire companies were responding here, and sadly, that home on Pitview Road was engulfed in flames and is a total loss. A massive amount of engine companies responded to the fire in the 100 block of Pitview Road in Ross Township. The ranch home was tucked back on a windy road. Down where it sits, uh, and obtaining the water supply took a little bit of time, but uh, uh, it seems like it got a good start. When I arrived, uh, we had uh, smoke uh, through the roof area. Fire hydrants were a distance from the house, and large numbers of engine companies were called to assist, as many as 20 in all, with six tanker trucks responding. Pretty chaotic. Um, it's never seen this many fire trucks and everything. I looked over behind my house, and I could see like the sky was orange and everything, and then we came over here and we saw like flames like pretty high up. This mother and son street. All the roads were blocked for hours. All the pair could do was hope he'd be okay. I feel really bad for him. I smelled the smoke right away and I looked over and I saw all the smoke in the fire and we walked down there was trees and everything on fire. The roof collapsed. Fire and smoke engulfed the residents home to this man. Firefighters say he was treated for smoke inhalation. Initial reporting is that uh, we possibly could be in a fireplace situation. He tried to extinguish the fire around the fireplace area, and when the smoke got too bad, he come out. Okay. And we're also told that several firefighters were treated at the scene here for reported chest pains. We're told it was extremely chaotic, as you heard, when all of these companies arrived on scene and the conditions were not good either. Very cold and windy out here. This went to a three alarm fire. The fire marshal will continue to investigate. The homeowner is okay, but he has lost everything. We're live in Ross Township. Pam Serrano, KDK News.